After 12 days of protests in the streets, the governor of Puerto Rico announcing his resignation. This follows a series of scandals and problems on the island that is still working to recover from Hurricane Maria. Tonight, our Alicia Niaves sat down with locals in the Puerto Rican community to find out what this event means for them. Hoy les anuncio que estaré renunciando al puesto del gobernador efectivo el viernes 2 de agosto del 2019. In a Facebook Live video Wednesday night, the governor of Puerto Rico, Ricardo Rosselló, resigned. For almost two weeks, hundreds of thousands marched in the streets of San Juan calling for the governor to leave office. Earlier this month, two former aides to the governor were arrested for fraud, involving more than $15 million in federal funding. I can say everything went wrong. Members of the Puerto Rican community in the Midlands say it was time for the corruption to stop. Every single thing in a governor went wrong. We chose a wrong governor. His dad was a governor, so he knew the responsibilities that this position had. The tipping point for many on the island was the treatment by the government to its people after Hurricane Maria. All the help that was never given to our people. There was a lot of food, a lot of water, a lot of aids that were not delivered to our people. And he also made fun of the people who died. Officials report more than 3,000 were killed. To this day, some in the more remote parts of the island are still without power. Hurricane Maria made landfall in September 2017. I came here um, after Hurricane Maria. Yolanda Gonzalez is from San Juan. She says after the hurricane hit, they lost power for three months. Generators nearby caused her family to have respiratory issues. We get asthma. We were in the hospital like a month with my kids. It was too hard for us. So she came to Colombia to be with family. The most shocking part was to know the government take advantage of a hurricane and they then take advantage of the people. This Sunday, the local Puerto Rican community will come together at La Isla Bonita restaurant to celebrate Governor Rosselló's resignation. And I want to reunite everybody from Georgia, uh, Charleston, Greenville, Augusta, Charlotte. The owner, Angela Crespo, says many are still suffering in Puerto Rico. Uh, we need somebody that works for the Puerto Ricans. Locals hope Wednesday's announcement will be just the beginning of a brighter future for the island. Governor Rosselló's resignation takes effect August 2nd. Wait for everybody to come Sunday and we together going to demonstrate that we are one together. Amen. There's no any greater feeling that to be a Boricua right now. Alicia Niaves, News 19, WLTX. Stay with us up next.